right guys so welcome to fac come to fac 1602 element financial accounting and and reporting okay uh, my, my name is washington Dutuma. i'm one of the lecturers at at noble tutors uh, thank you for, for for joining us okay guys uh in this video you want, I just want to illustrate to you uh, the overview of the module, what should be expected of you from, from the module, and how we're also going to, to tackle this module. Uh, it's not that much of a difficult module, uh, as, as long as you put uh, much effort, uh, it's, not, it's not that difficult. Okay. So for each and every topic that we have, we're going to have a video for that topic, and in each and every video, we're going to answer uh, an exam question from the previous previous exam question papers. So for that topic, we go and look from the previous exam questions to see. Okay, this is the the question that they asked in this topic. Okay, let's 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 answer this question so that you also see how do you answer these questions if you are in the exam and what is expected of you uh, if you are in the what if you are in the exam and how do you get the minimum marks. You know, or sorry, the maximum max you know that can be that you can get from each and every question. Okay, so this is how we're going to to do it. We're going to start with partnership. We're going to start with partnership. Partnership, and in our partnership, we're going to have two videos. One, we're going to calculate whether the business. The business you've made profit or the business you've made loss. We're going to calculate whether the business have made profit or the business have made what? It made loss. Okay. In our second video, we're going to do a statement of changes in equity. Statement of changes in equity. Okay. In this video now we are looking to say okay, after the business have made the profit. After the partnership have made profit, what do they do with the profit? Still in the second video, we're going to do the statement of financial position. Statement of financial position. So in our partnership, we're going to have two videos. We're going to calculate the profit and we're going to share the profit to the partners. Okay. Then from the partnership, we're going to go to close cooperation. Close cooperation. Then our close cooperation, we're going to do statement of profit or loss again. We're going to do statement of profit or loss again. But after our statement of profit or loss, we're going to say, okay, how are we going to share the profit or the loss that the that the close cooperation have made? So we're going to prepare a statement of changes in net investment and we're going to have two videos again in the second video we're going also to have a statement of financial position statement of financial position for close cooperation statement of financial position for close cooperation then after close cooperation after the close cooperation we are now going to cash flows Cash flows, we're going to have two videos. Cash flows, now we are now focusing on, on the cash part of the business. How much cash was it received? How much cash was it paid? So we're looking at the opening bank balance and we're looking at the closing bank balance. And how did the cash went up, went down, went up, went down? So in the cash flow, we have the direct method. We're going to have a video for the direct method. And we're going to have a video for investing and financing activities. Okay. Uh, most of you might be confused on what I'm writing here. I'm just giving an introduction on on how we're going to to tackle the the topics that 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 we have. And after the cash flows, we're going to have changes in the ownership structure 
of a close cooperation okay so here you find out that how many videos are we going to have how many videos are we going to have going to have two for partnership two for close cooperation two for cash flows and one for changes in the ownership so we have two four six so we're going to have seven videos each and every video addressing each and every topic right okay guys uh, so in this module you'll find out that here in may june 20 2019 what was asked was partnership close cooperation statement of change in net investment uh, close cooperation statement of cash flow so prior statement of what statement statement of financial position okay so what you need what you need to understand is that uh, partnership uh, close cooperation and cash flows it's greater than it's the, the these three topics they cover uh, greater than 70 percent of your what of your of your exam so this 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 module is not that difficult but you also need to understand each and every concept that is going to be examined you know, because there are a lot of statements that you're going to to prepare there whether it's a partnership and it's a close cooperation there's a statement there's a statement and these statements they have formats that you're supposed to know before you go to the what before you go to the to the exam so each and every each and every video or each and every topic will be addressing the questions from the previous question from the previous questions or of the previous exams then we also do it and we also say how are we going to answer the the question and you also say okay how to get the maximum marks from each and every what from each and every question okay guys i'll i'll, I'll see you in the partnership video thank you